Hello and welcome back to a series that totally shouldn't have died months ago. Today we are going to fight Enidwaith, I think. Again, or more of them. Well, well. Yee. Yee! Let's see. Uh, we do need... You know, do need all the little doobity doob doo doos. I mean, retraining is nice and all, but uh, I mean, not too useful if we don't actually, you know, train any more troops and we spend all our time retraining them instead. So, uh, yeah, start marching troops down. Hmm, get rid of all the glorious chaff. Once we get rid of the trash, we've done any warband there. Terrible, kind of, sort of, mostly. Let's uh, sending an army down here. Hey, here you are. Not the greatest of armies, but it's something. Atreith, uh, you can't train much. Uh, right. I don't think there's much left to do this turn. Uh, no, I went through everything, so now I'm just... At this point, I'd just be going through everything again, where I might as well do it the next turn. No, oh, look, more dwarves. I really do need to get rid of them. Oh, boy, elves. Elves are my... favorite. I was almost concerned that was more elves, but no, it's a rune. Just saw, just saw something moving, and I'm like... Help. Not again. One thing that's kind of nice... <coughs> uh, if you do siege the elves, they can't train any units. Uh, that's that's kind of nice, I guess. It's, 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 it's something. Yay. Minas Morgul besieged. Oh god, what the fuck is going on in this game? It's turn 214, and Minas Tirith should have fallen a hundred turns ago. So, uh, that, that's the point we're at. It's, uh... Pro promising. I, um... I'm truly excited to see what we'll see down there, if we ever make it that far. Meanwhile, build... more of all the things. Uh, actually, you need culture, first and foremost. Argond, uh, you're that. It will be uh, right. This army does need to die. Because, yeah, that army does need to die. Because I ain't... Dealing with having to reinforce my back lines all the time. Well, well, pushing them down. Because it would take too long to get rid of Enidwraith as a faction. For me to actually be able to just push past the stacks. Because I'll have to leave that much land defend. It's like, could just use the armies. Be a lot easier. Hmm. Start deployment. Should be a fairly simple battle. You go like that, and all of you. Like that. And then we just march forward. Because, uh... Not too concerned about this fight. We've kind of got them outnumbered. Not like the other ones where we were outnumbered, us fucking orcs. Any more on the flank here? Yes, I do. Well, if you can go around there, you go there. Every charge. 
And the poor bastards will uh, probably try to run away. At least with the ranged units. But yeah, I don't need all of you there. Mm, you can help with the pikemen. Over there. Pikemen can help out with the outlaws. These pikemen, well, I mean, you're doing good here. Uh, you are, well, you're flanking around, I guess. Might have made it, made them go a bit wide. Well, <sighs> don't think this will be a hard battle. Mm, pikes, I do love pikes. Pokey, 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 pokey. Pokey, pokey. Pikemen are just so much better than even the Marauders. Where the pikemen do not shine, however, is against uh, ranged units. Put them against the ranged units and they're going to be owie. Okay, well, I'm going to sacrifice that unit. Fuck it. Uh... So yesterday I was playing, uh, well, yesterday, with today being Wednesday, I was playing um, Crusader Kings 2 with a couple of friends, which I've, I've never actually played with Crusader Kings multiplayer before, and it's actually quite fun. I mean, I'm sure it depends a lot on uh, how you play it, but playing with a couple of new people, unsurprisingly, uh, yeah, more of a co-op campaign. That was actually quite fun. Uh, one of them decided to play as Catholic, while the two of us decided to play as um, pagans. It didn't take long for the ca for the guy who played Catholic to be like, "I won't be pagan." Uh, and of course, we got the most cancer start possible as pagans because uh, we're playing the um, the earliest start, the Charlemagne start, and uh, lucky for us, yeah, the. Uh, the, the rarest of the rare of things happened. The Holy Roman Empire formed after like 40 years. Which means they ate up all of France, ate Italy, ate a bunch of Germany. There you go. The Holy Roman Empire, right in the beginning. Whoop de fucking do. Always fun as a pagan ruler. It's, uh, it's truly a promising development of. Nothing else. No, yeah. Well, thankfully, we seem to be doing fairly okay, all things considered. I mean, since we're playing with, like, there's two newish people, when you're playing at, like, generally keeping at a speed too. It's like, a decent, it's fucking terribly boring if you're playing alone, but if you're, if you're playing with friends, that's that becomes kind of acceptable. I mean, you do have those swaths of time where just nothing happens, but, uh, they're not quite as bad. We're done being slow pokes yet? Good. Hmm. Uh, that, 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 that game will had a special start with the whole Roman Empire forming and me playing as uh, Sherland, which would be Denmark. My first ruler died in a timely manner, because, I mean, the ruler starts off disgustingly old, so fair enough. My second ruler... Managed to die three months after of severe stress at the age of 40 something. It's like. Really, game? Just fucking really? That, 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 that was fucking cancerous. Which, which got me stuck with a kid, and it made me lose half my territory, because fucking gavel kind. It was, uh. Great fun. Now, ah, forces of Haleth, come here. I think this is the only units that are still fighting. Maybe that one. No, it looks like it's running away. Ah, oh, yeah, it was. <coughs> God. 
It's fucking sick, that's the weirdest thing ever. Like, first we get the sniffles, then we get the coughs, then we get the shits, then we get the coughs again. Uh, fucking weird. Ugh, sons of Denethor are sister of Ringwraith, but were defeated by the Black Captain. Hmm, here's a, here's a villain deal. I don't remember that segment from the book. Uh, merge you. And movie, movie, southy, southy. Uh, you need to get down here, because, uh, Dolvorn might not be able to hold. Might not. Oh. What loss with Haradrim tribes? Wow. Well, um. So, so, so shocked and, oh, horrible, horrible. Worst thing ever. Hmm. Could actually use some cavalry. We're just chaff armies, cavalry's not actually a terrible idea. Uh, <laughs> if they attacked me, I'd be dead. Which doesn't surprise me too much. Mm, that's a full stack. Take Dunard. That would be more land taken, which means frontline push for the south. Mm. Anything to recruit here? Yes. I mean, I guess I could recruit here. Doesn't hurt. Some Lardris. Oh, good. I can recruit from you now. Getting your culture up. Nice and good. And recruit trash units from here. Uh, outside of that, we're not doing much this turn. It's, uh, I'm not entirely confident in what's here. Where it's you... Worshippers of Morgoth. Well, I think all of them would be. Fucking hell. I'm gonna get it from that. If, if that's... Of course, that's a retinue. Fucking, fucking stupid me. Not a trade, it's fucking retinue. Duh. This is why you pay attention to what the fuck you're doing. It might have been slightly in um, Crusader Kings mode, where you don't have retinues. You have... Court. And while well, anything that shows up in that kind of location will always be your traits. Hmm. This Kings 2 is fun though. Uh, it's kind of a special game. Oh boy. Good god, anyways, I have a lot of stacks. Fucking hell! Well. I think we might be the one getting out spammed at this point. Uh, that's a lot of stacks they have. It doesn't help that we're also fighting Rohan. Hmm, guys are at the fat. Where's you? Cotton Doom. Well, okay. Minas Morgul liberated. Well, <laughs> how is the clap? Fucking well done. Fucking well done. Y'all managed to fucking done goof that bad. That's 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 fucking impressive. I'm Lardris, ball breeder. I'll storehouse then. This money. Oh, we totally need. And then again, having money is not a bad thing. Uh, merge you. Like, we're making good money, yes. Doesn't necessarily mean we shouldn't be making more. Okay, I I'm reaching the point where I'll just start shitting out things everywhere. Just throwing them at the enemy. Like the true orcs as we are. Shit out everything. It's, uh, that's, uh... That's some stacks they've got there. Let's go deal with you instead. Actually, no. Let's not attack them. We'll just deal with them. 
Uh, well, I felt it's a something, I guess. It's more than nothing. Uh, okay, this is actually a proper elite army, so I'm not too concerned about Rohan, because uh, lots of pikemen. Next turn, that should be done, or another just full stack just swarm down. So that's kind of what I'm needing to do at this point, because uh, ended with the Ruan just cancer to fight. I, I have no idea how Gondo will be at this point in the game, since they're capable of pushing Mordor back. So... You together, there we go, a half decent stack there. Nothing to actually recruit here. Hmm. Lord of the Rings soundtrack was... The soundtrack was generally pretty good. Oh, I don't remember the name of who composed it, but it's pretty good. Uh, military, Rune is actually number one. Financial, Dwarves of Khazad Doom are the ones who have no settlements are number one on finances. That's that's beautiful. Uh, let's check military ranking for Mordor. Well, they've been going up. But what about Gondor? Gonna, 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 gonna. Oh, they're right here. Right in between us. Means Gondor is now stronger than Mordor. Fucking well done, evil AI. Well done. You did the fuck. You did the impossible. You screwed yourself over that bad. Oh, good God. That's I'm, I'm genuinely fucking impressed. This is the kind of thing that's making me really want to just push and push and push. And if I keep throwing chaff stacks at the enemy, I might be able to with just auto assaults. Uh, I can't be fucked. I just can't be fucked. It's a waste of time. It's not interesting for anyone to see me lose a battle with three units. It's just a waste of time. Greetings. I come bearing word. Shadow of Mirkwood wants trade offer. Sure, why not? What could possibly go wrong? Uh, let's see. Things are... Uh... Yes, what I will do now that I have Florian somewhat under control is I'll just keep pushing down there. Lead Tash. Okay, I'm going to have to go through and muster everything here. I'm just send them south as well. Oh, hey. That's another one done. I'm glad. What about Veen? Uh, unit culture. Wounding arm is sighted. That's dwarves. Uh, this one? I... I'll fight. This one I'll fight. Uh, probably don't get you to. Then move you south. Worst case, the army will die. But at this point, I don't care. Just throw everything out there. Throw things everywhere. Get ready for fighting. Come on. Objective complete. Throw everything together. Uh, let's see, we have a bunch of stuff here as well. Shagrat. Well, you're coming with me. Uh, you, 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 you. And you are all going south. And you are as well. Hmm, I like that settlement. It'll, it'll keep itself nice and supplied with Gundabad guards. They're pretty strong troops. 
trolls, guardians. Throw together a bunch of guardians. I can just merge them, so that's not a problem. Uh, there's a lot of pikemen out there. Not entirely certain why I trained them, but I did. Uh, don't have a general, but that's okay. The cavalry unit has a general, why not? Uh, do we have a scourge raiders? Yes, we do. Nothing else can get to be halberds. And then we fill in the rest with marauders. There you go. Time to go south. Uh... Oh, terrain's not much help. Oh, you know, we could just do this. Uh, okay, battle. Uh, oh, fuck it. It's the worst that could happen. I say, yes, uh, I've seen what the worst thing that could happen before has been. Right, you need to be dealt with. Uh, you know what? Troll, you're going to get to be a captain. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Uh, right. Uh, yeah, we're not doing trolls. Means we're doing pikemen. Pikemen. Then we're doing orders. Then we're doing ghost raiders. We're doing halberds. Doing more halberds. And then last we just have to be marauders. And you get to go play with dwarves. Uh, anything else you can train here? Yes, there is. Good stuff. Plays me. Summon sound of Dolvornia. That, uh, it's kind of unavoidable. Stack there. Uh, well, I, yeah. Does they need a general? Like, do they really need a general? I'm old as I can know. 94. Well, he'll die at some point. I haven't been using him much. I was like, I don't really want to waste my faction. <laughs> it's like, at this point, the battles I need him for are the battles that I can lose. So it's like, eh, do I really want to? <laughs> Oh, God, this cough. But I really should be using him more, but it's like... Uh, what I should do is move him between armies, as I like, just keep moving the armies around. Now, we have a battle to deal with here. Uh, fuck it. Auto Resolve. I think we'll want to try to make some progress here. Uh, there's five. There you go. Uh, you can go Argon for now. Let's well pop down Watchtower here, as we can. Uh, okay, you're moving down. Oh, time. It's, it's time to stop uh, twiddling our thumbs and actually get something done. Is that a rebel settlement I see there? It's grey. It's, uh, that's rebel colours. Why? I'm pretty sure the elves had it earlier. Yep, here we go. Not entirely unexpected. This I'll probably have to manual. Yes, I will. Uh, I want to kill Brian. Again, with these generals, killing them is kind of cancerous. Oh, good, they have two of them as well, because they have the archer unit. And guess what? Range units are my one weakness. Along with cavalry. Cavalry, not so much, but range units are... Ah, because I don't have cavalry myself, and the cavalry I have is pretty garbage, really. 
they have all the uh, downsides to the Medieval 2 Heavy Cavalry while having none of the upsides. Uh, okay, well I guess we'll just charge, really. So I want to get them killed. The quicker I can engage them and kill them, the less I'll have to deal with these while dealing with the reinforcements. Uh, you go there, there. Pikeman on that flank, apparently. That should be a decent enough place to start, I guess. There we go. Micro as we have to. Um, what the fuck are you guys doing? These uh, range units are painful, though. Uh, let's see. I'd like to get the general, but yeah, that's uh, a lot easier said than done. If I could get the general, that might be enough to make them break. Look those. Pokemon go there. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, that's a nice... That's a nice little flank we got going on here. And there are Mood Keepers and the uh, Pikes. Uh, you are not doing jack shit. Means you can just go run off somewhere and get something done. I kind of anticipated this happening. That little flank there, which is why I made sure the general was on the other side. One enemy general down. Good stuff. Uh, that's the entire flank broken. That's good stuff. Pictures. And here are the reinforcements. We're not done down here. Well, there's going to be a few and it's lost at least. Probably more. Uh, you are Scourge Raiders. Well, I guess I just have to deal with the Great Lord Raiders as they come. Now we just need to keep pushing them. Mood Keepers. Trying the luck. There, luck got kinda screwed. Need to get the pikemen down. The fighting. The pikemen are what's do is the proper fighting. Everything else is. I mean, everything else is just chaff at this point, because, uh, yeah. Okay, look at the stats. It's all pikemen. It's pikemen, pikemen, pikemen. So, that's everything that does anything in these battles. Plus, most of our stuff is just based on making the enemy route, really. Uh, can get the center, just finish off these. That'll free up more units. Uh, I'm not entirely confident in these. I just, I just don't have the quality units needed to fight these blobs that they keep sending at me. Which is kind of a problem.
If only I did have the quality, then everything would go so much better. He's supposed to fight those, to turn to those. Uh, anyone not doing anything? Yes, you are not doing anything. So you go over there. You ain't doing much. You can flank around. Whatever you can do, I guess. Uh, this unit is dead. There's no point even trying to help them. Now the enemy general down. Good. Charge, you dumb fox. Here we go. Nice flank. You go after that. Uh, small moot keepers over there. If you can push through there. Okay, we have one unit routing. That's uh, the one that's in terrible condition already. Well, I'll save for it even on casualties. Uh, God, I wish, I wish I had time to flank them. But I just don't. Uh, fellas, fellas, fellas. You, on the other hand, you do have the opportunity to flank. Okay, let's see. What do we have and where do we have it? Okay, you help out there. Y'all ain't do nothing. If I push you through here. And you go through here. You'll hopefully get to play with the pikemen. Distracted pikemen or dead pikemen? There we go. They're broken. You just keep moving. Keep moving. You wanna you wanna get in nice and close on the flank here. Uh, these units, on the other hand, don't want the general to do anything at this point. Uh, those, well, they can just do whatever they want, really. I don't have the troops to stop them. Uh, you can go through here. And keep the range units distracted. Oh yeah, no. The this blob is gonna have a horrible time soon. They are not in a good spot. They managed to get themselves surrounded. One of the things the pikemen are just so good at: just spreading out all across this flank, and well, providing pokey bits everywhere. Let's see, 57 to 64. Yep, we are taking the lead. Significantly so as well. So there. Might be about to chain route here. Might be. Oh, you done? Okay, that's nice. Yep, there they go. Fluff. That's everything just leaves. And that's pretty much the end of the battle. There's not a hole left they can, they can do now. 74% of enemies down. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Everything just round everywhere.
Well, hello there, River Elders. I hear you like uh, stabby bits. Well, guess who has longer stabby bits? Oh, God. Flanking pikemen are terrifying creatures. Uh, is there much left now? Don't think so. Uh, so the raiders died. There you go. The end of the battle. There's nothing left to capture because we don't have cavalry and we can't outrun them like elves could. There we go. That's uh, we're getting a lot of the more special battles with Enidwaith because we're fairly evenly matched in terms of units. Well, I tend tend to have a couple of more elites than they do, but they have ranged on the other hand. Oh look, we captured one of the generals. Oh, too bad for him. He's uh, he's not captured no more. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, I'm glad they didn't send in that army. Uh. Save the battle. This is, uh, this looks like a leftover army. <laughs> so does mine. Yeah. Well, this time, we're outnumbered. <coughs> but not outclassed. Which means fighting defensively is not, still not much of an option, because they have ranged. We do not. But. We have the high ground. Yeah, my general just can't fight in this battle. He just can't. Uh, I don't like this. Beep, 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 beep. Yes, we are totally Rohan. Down to Master Ruhirim of Orcs. Don't worry about it. We're uh, we only change the culture, nothing else. We're we're st we're still, but well, no, we only change race, not not culture. We we're still Rohan, not Heart or something. We're still the sons of Aeorl. Mm, low effort battles, they're the best. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory mm, also, rain is also the best. I'm hoping it's not coming through too loudly. It's, uh... Oh, we're not having cancer weather again, as always. Norway, yay! It's uh, kind of a thing that tends to happen here. Mm, raiders. Dead raiders. It's almost like you really shouldn't be fighting the pikemen. Hey, what do I know? Okay, well, the hillmen are holding the ground here, so meh. Don't need to move or send the general anywhere. Uh, okay, that's a problem. Okay, can you finish off killing these? Oh. Uh, then you do that. Oh, you finish up them. Oopsie. Oh, there we go. They got their support. Uh, they've lost half the men, and we have not. That's uh, that's a good sign. Okay, you are practically done fighting whatever you were fighting. You are already encircling them without me even telling you to. Yeah, well, charge the Grateful Raiders in the back. Complete the encirclement. Not much left on that side, so just change priorities. Uh... Hillmen are done. 
Time to run down some range units. Ah, fuck it. Be brave, General. Oh, okay. They weren't brave. Uh, you're done. Those spearmen are not, however. Okay, I'm okay with that. I'm perfectly okay with them just charging into melee like that. That's fucking great, actually. It means I don't have to run them down. Ah, uh, imagine the disgustingness if you could form a shiltrum of pikes. That would that that would be something real special. No, oh, guess we won this one too. I don't have much of an army left at this point, though. Uh, okay, that's an actual problem. That's an actual problem. Oh, they're just routing. Okay. Well, not routing, but they're withdrawing. Hmm. Kill them all. We we yell. Hmm. Slaughtered. Oh, not catching up to them. So done with that battle. Whew. Another one done. At least that one was nice and quick. Uh, execute. Uh -huh. That that banner is starting to empty out real nice. Uh, I'm wondering if we'll have to... Yes, we'll have to end it here, because this one might actually take a while. Means, save. First, save battle. Then, save. Or save! Uh, and then, un until next time, we'll have a nice siege battle for what's probably going to be another Black Gate. But this time, we have the timer enabled. Yay!